How do you think you're gonna pick up that cart girl with those dirty clubs in your bag, okay? Today, I'm gonna show you how to clean your golf clubs using WD-40 and nail polish to make them look brand new. Stay tuned. Oh, that coffee sucks. I took my brother's clubs, so Wes, if you're watching this, you're welcome for cleaning your clubs. Look how dirty those are. Cause he chunks the ball. You chunk the ball, bro. Stop chunking the ball. Anyways, you guys saw the materials. Brush, soap. What we're gonna do here? Get the brush wet. Wipe off the excess dirt and grime. Wow, you chunked the ball, Wesley. Jeez. We're gonna get a drop of soap here. Put it on just like that, back and forth. Guys, in the last video I made of this, you guys were like roasting me, telling me not to dunk my clubs in the water. You were saying like I'm a bad golfer. I didn't even hit the ball. Um, some very personal comments. I like it. Do that again, okay? Because that's how I get more views, so thank you. Make sure you get the back of the club here, boys. Don't get uh, water or anything around here because that can cause rust, apparently. Make sure you get the stuff in the grooves because that's where you get the spin from. All back here. What is this green stuff on your clubs, Wesley? Jeez. Don't go too hard, you can scratch the club. And then, uh, I'm in the kitchen sink here, boys. So you can do a little bit of this, right? Make sure it's nice and clean. Boom, dry it off right away. Guys, this is the middle of winter outside, so I'm doing this inside, and I haven't been able to golf. I did make a simulator though, so stay tuned for that video of making the simulator. I'll pop up a video of me um, shanking my drive and hitting the ceiling. That wasn't good. Guys, don't forget to clean your grips when you're cleaning your clubs. So, you have this, make sure this is clean because you don't want to be rubbing dirt. A little bit of soap. Soap makes it sticky, tackier. All right, just back and forth. Really gently. One time I did this uh, not very gently with my putter grip and uh, it like fell apart. So that's not good. That's not good. That's why I can't sink any putts, boys. Look at this. Look at this. Look at that. Wesley, you're welcome for cleaning your clubs, buddy. The only difference with this, make sure you get the face clean. Wow, you shank your driver too, Wesley. Jesus. Now the only difference with this is uh, don't go too crazy around here. Just give the top a little wipe because you don't want to scratch it. Look at that. Look at that. Hitting doinks with this driver. Doinks. You should see how good I am with it. Subscribe so you can see. Moving on to the putter, boys. Wes, you sink no putts with your putter. So maybe after I clean it, it might be a better look. A little bit of dirt in the grooves there. Just nicely clean it off, brush it off. Guys, you can do this in the kitchen sink in a bucket. Really doesn't matter. I really don't care. I don't care what you guys say. Just comment below. Rude or nice, anything. Say it, I don't care. All right, now they're all clean and shiny. Let's get some WD-40 on these guys. I'll show you how it shines them up. Cleans them a little bit more and cleans inside the grooves. And then uh, we can use some nail polish. I'll show you guys that trick. Guys, ran to the store, WD-40 and a new coffee. The one I made was garbage. Don't tell anybody this trick because you're going to be playing so much better. Here, a little spray on the face. All right. A little spray on the back. And, uh, and just in the back here. Take some of this. Dishes are gonna smell and taste like WD-40. That's not good. Wipe it down. Don't do this right before you're around, guys, because then your uh, face is gonna be a bit slippery. You don't want that. This is kind of more for like winter storage or if you're displaying your clubs wanting to look shiny. Look how clean that is. Look how shiny that is right there, guys. Face, you can see scratches. You can see a little bit of extra dirt even though I washed it. So, take WD-40. Oh, mm. I love WD-40. Look at how nice, clean, and shiny that is. 
My sister's room is just like a war zone in there. Holy. I got some nail polish, guys. I'm using an old set of clubs. I don't wanna, I don't wanna damage Wesley's. The beauty of using nail polish is if you mess up, it don't matter. There's something called nail polish remover. Hey, look at the before. Okay. Not too bad, but not good. Don't be worried if you get it a bit out of the lines. Really get it in the lines there. Oops. Ah, shit. Let that sit and dry for a while, boys. You can do details too, boys. Check out this bladed three iron that I got from uh, Talis. Put a little bit of uh, green and blue. You guys do not know how hard it was to get that. I went to Sephora, they didn't have it. So I had to text up the girl from school. It's all dry now. Okay, you guys might be worried like, oh my God, there's nail polish on the edges. How do you get that off? Let me just quickly show you. Mom, sorry for making such a mess in the kitchen too. I probably won't clean it up, but I am sorry. Start wiping away. Start wiping away. Don't go too crazy though. Careful. Cause you don't want to wipe away the stuff on the inside. Make sure the edges are all nice. Look at the before and after on that, guys. Look at that. Wow. Boys, there you have it. I look forward to reading all the rude comments again. Make sure you comment, subscribe, like the video. Okay, stay tuned. We got some bangers coming up. Until next time, peace. Wes, you owe me $10 for cleaning your clubs.